it's it's Cogsy here and I'll be doing another e-liquid review for you today. Uh, the one we're going to be reviewing today is Blackberry by Dark Star Vapor. As you can see there now, these were on a mad deal. If you go on the website, I still think it's uh, something pretty crazy. We got an introduction offer. I think it was seven bottles for seven pounds with postage. Uh, so yeah, definitely head to their website if you want to try something a bit different, a new company. Um, me and my dad both bought seven bottles each and we haven't moaned about any of the flavours really. A few that are a bit weird, try and get reviews on those as well. But I mean, uh, I think it's now about seven for £10 or seven for £11, something around that. About one fifty a bottle on their own, so it's pretty crazy pricing for a 10ml bottle of e-liquid. Right, in here, this is the mini BCC tank by the way. I have the Blackberry liquid ready to fire. I'll be firing it at 4 volts. Um, you know, we'll give you an idea of vapour production, everything like that. So I'll knock that up to 4 volts. We'll give you an idea of vapour production visually, um, taste, what I'm getting. You know, if I'd vape this all day, which is something that I don't really consider with liquids, but a lot of them, I'll vape for, a, you know, a, a few days and then I'll, I'll be pretty much sick of them. So I'll give you an idea with this. Now, Blackberry... I like my fruit liquids, this one should be a thumbs up, let's give it a go. Now for a bottom coil tank, I don't usually get the best vapour but that was a really good vape. Um, big thick cloud of vapour, very nice sweet uh, tangy taste in my throat, reminiscent I'm not comparing here, but reminiscent to a trip hammer sort of fruit. Uh, you know, that, that sweetie, go to your, your local sweet shop, you know, pick up some blackberry sweets. That's the sort of flavour I'm getting from this. I'll do a bit of a longer vape now, see if I can put out a better cloud than that, even though that was a good cloud. And that's another good cloud there. I'm really not moaning with this liquid so far. Very nice, tangy, blackberry flavour, very thick, uh, not necessarily on the fruity side, more on the sweet side. So, I mean, we're getting kind of artificial blackberry flavour there, but not that that's a bad thing. I mean, I, I like, you know, the, the sweety taste in my uh, in my vape. I, I am a fan of, of you know, not knocking out uh, the, the sweety flavours compared to the really, you know, official sort of fruit flavours. I'd much rather have, the, the way I'm putting it, I'd much rather have something that tastes like a, a soda, a, a drink, than I would the actual thing. So I'd rather have a tango orange flavour than a uh, actual freshly squeezed orange flavour. That's just me personally. I'm a fan of this. I think this is a great liquid to have in my tank. All day vape. Maybe not. A bit too sweet maybe for an all day vape. I mean, I'd go more... Uh, can't really think. Purple Bomb by Only e Liquid. I think that was a great liquid. That was a, a pleasant all day vape for me. Um, I mean this, I don't know if I'd go with a sweet flavour for an all day vape myself either way. I usually go for a mellow tobacco sort of coffee flavour for an all day vape. So I'll often buy in a Hang Sen 30-50ml uh, whatever um, tobacco flavour. But for a, uh, you know, a I don't know. I don't know when best to vape this. I mean, it could be an all-day vape for you. Could be a kind of after-dinner sort of vape. Um, in the morning, I like something really powerful, maybe a menthol. Um, this I could see after a meal. Saying that, yeah, I, I think uh, an after after dinner sort of vape this would be. Um, throat it. I'll give you another vape and give you an idea of throat it. I'll straight lung it as well. Yeah, the, there's definitely a throat it there. I mean, milligrams. This is a 1.2 percent, so that's 12 milligram nicotine. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not moaning on the throat it either. To be honest, it's, it's definitely there. It's quite lasting. I mean, I can still feel it now. So it's definitely the sort of liquid that, um, as a smoker transition into vaping, you know, you're gonna get the, the full, the full deal. You're going to get the throat it, you're going to get the, you know, the, the feeling, the, the nicotine. I mean, by percentage, whatever you want. I usually go for zeros now. But, I mean, if, if, you, if you're a smoker transitioning to vaping and you want a nice fruit sweet flavour, I'm going to have to recommend 
Dark Stars uh, Blackberry. If you're a fan of Blackberry, they've also got Black Currant, Blueberry, uh, you know, other all, other sort of berry flavors, traditional fruit flavors, but kind of with a sweeter, sweety taste to them. So I'd say, uh, yeah, definitely, I, I'd recommend this. This is a thumbs up from me. Um, a good liquid, very well priced at the moment. I mean, head over to the website. Good guys, you know, shipping didn't take too long. Postage is barely anything if you're in the UK. So give this liquid a go. That's what I say. I mean, you can do do what you please, but my recommendation is good fruit liquid in my tank right now. Thank you for watching, guys. Um, as always, you know, like, comment, uh, give your opinions, what you do like, what you don't like. If you don't like my hat, um, if a hat being backwards is offensive in your community, I'm not too sure. Uh, I've done this because I haven't done my hair today and isn't looking the best, as my friend told me earlier. I have got a sore throat, so that's why my voice might seem a bit croaky. But uh, there should be a subscribe box up there somewhere, Twitter box up there somewhere. Um, follow me on Twitter for constant updates on my personal life, vaping, any deals I've found, what I'm up to. Um, and yeah, as always, vape on guys. Thank you for watching.